In this video you will learn how to make a text animation like this in Blender. Blender version 2.82a is being used while creating this video. Let's start by deleting this cube. Click this cube to select it, and press X and enter to delete it. Add some text by pressing Shift plus A, Text. Press Tab to enter text editing mode and enter your text. Press Tab to exit edit mode. Rotate it on X axis by pressing R, X, 90 and enter. Zoom with mouse wheel up, pan with shift plus middle button and rotate with middle mouse button until you get view something like this. Come here and click this text object properties icon. Click this geometry to expand some settings. Set this extrude value to 0.05. Set this bevel depth value to 0.01. And set this bevel resolution value to 0 and press enter. Now come over here and click this object menu, click convert to, and click mesh from curve meta surf text. If you press Z key and wireframe, you will notice that geometry are not properly distributed. Come back to solid view by pressing Z key and solid. Come here and click this little modifier icon, click add modifier and click remesh modifier. Now uncheck this remove disconnect places box. Increase this octree depth until you get best result. In this case I'm going to set it up to 7, then check this smooth shading box and click this apply button. Now click this object data properties icon and under the normal section, check auto smooth. Now if you switch to wireframe view, you can see the geometry evenly distributed. Switch back to solid view and scale it on Z axis by pressing S, Z, 0.5 and enter. Go to this object menu, click set origin and origin to geometry. Now press shift plus S keys, and click selection to cursor. Press Ctrl plus A keys and apply all transforms. Press 1 on the number pad for the front view, and pan the view to the center. Come over here and click this modifier icon, click add modifier and add wave modifier. Come down to the timeline section and click play button. You can see the text animation now but we have to change some settings for better result. Pause this animation and click this icon to go to the first frame. Change this offset value to 10, so that the wave animation starts only at frame number 10. Come down here and change the speed value to 0.1 to decrease the wave speed. Set this width value to 4 to increase the wave width. And set the height value to 1.5, which changes the height of wave. Now if you play the animation, you can notice changes in waves. Now pause the animation and click this icon to go to the first frame. Since this wave is starting from the center of the text, we want it to be started from the left side. To do so, add in a empty by pressing shift plus a, empty and plane axis. Come here and click this move icon to enable moving hands and click and drag this red arrow to the left like this. Select this text. Go back to the modifier section, click this little square icon next to start point, and select empty from the list. Now if you play the animation, you can see that the wave is starting at the empties location. Pause the animation and go to the first frame. You can uncheck this cyclic box if you don't want to repeat the animation. You can see that the animation is playing only once now. Now pause the animation and click this icon to go to the first frame. Click and drag this timeline section little bit upwards. Now click and drag this playhead until your animation ends properly. Since this animation has ended at frame 70, we are going to set this end frame value to 70 itself. So that the animation does not go beyond 70 frames. 
Finally click this play button to view the final text animation. And this was a very short tutorial about how to make a simple text animation using wave modifier in Blender. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and leave a comment.